It's insane. This thing. is the new Dead by Daylight announcement trailer. And it kind of came out of, honestly, out of Dead by Daylight's ass. It came out, like, right out of fucking nowhere. Like, I woke up, and I saw it on fucking Twitter, and I'm like, really? Because they, they usually don't release this shit this early. At least, like, at least this kind of teaser shit, and they make it this obvious. So, um, let's just, let's just click on it, and I'll show you guys what, I, what it is, okay? All right, so right here is just the fucking rest of the page and blah, blah, blah. I'm going to show you exactly right here. This is the, all that really matters, okay? So let's full screen it right now. Um, This is really f f cool and bad, in my opinion, right? And I'm going to explain right away what this is all about. Basically, as you can it kind of understand, it's the ring. What you might not understand is down below. Now, this little bar right here is kind of hard to tell, so forgive me. But it says, um, Kadoko, um, what is it? Kado Kawa, um, and then production group, all rights reserved, um, and then I think it's like for um, blah 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 trademarks. Basically, what that you really gotta know for that is, um, it's not coming from the movies. It's coming from the original fucking book, which is amazing. Because if you guys don't know, Ghostface, the reason that chapter was really fucking great. And it still is, is because they didn't go to Scream from Paramount Productions or Paramount Pictures. Forgive me. They went there because um, they went to um, the people that actually made the fucking masks for like Halloween costumes, and they got permission from them. So basically, they can f make um, the character however the fuck they really want because they've got the look, and that's all that matters for the killer, right? And the cool thing too is um now they can make obviously different skins like we just got the um what was it the um phantom the frost phantom or whatever it was right um and then we also have the blighted scream mask which you you don't get if it's um a lot of very tight regulated um killers let's say freddy who doesn't have a fucking skin at all or michael myers which only has like one skin which looks kind of poopy and then like a few fucking weapons right so it's this is really good because we don't know what this ring character is going to look like. We kind of, we can kind of infer some stuff, but we don't know. And what um, this also means is that, in my opinion, it's probably going to look different. It's going to be more like how um, the author, because they're working together with the people that actually made the, the book, right? Which, that's sick, um, in my opinion. But it really, it's almost like half a real chapter, half not. And I love that. Moving forward, though. Um and talking about this thing that I really um, enjoy. And also kind of dislike is that first off, if you guys don't know, the spirit was kind of more or less like obviously inspired by things such as the ring and the grudge, which are like Asian Japanese um, spirits, you know, evil spirits and um, that was also because, you know, they probably wouldn't get the rights and they didn't think so, but obviously here we are, now they can. And what I'm kind of scared about is, cool, they got the character, right? However, what's going to probably happen is the same thing that happened with Bubba and Hillbilly, and I really don't want that to happen. They're probably not going to fuck up that bad, but the thing I really hate and I'm really scared of is if they fucking grab this license, essentially, and they make this character look the same and it, very bland because if you guys don't know hillbilly and bubba basically they grabbed most of hillbilly's set and slapped it onto bubba and people were really pissed out uh pissed off about that when uh, bubba first came out because there's just such a basic set and people have grown to appreciate bubba now especially with like kind of like a rework but um we're gonna be very careful about that so that this killer doesn't come out and just feel completely generic because i hate when um that happens it's it's very disappointing so um it's kind of like I like Trickster because I can see the potential, but I can see also why some people wouldn't like Trickster because it's kind of like a rehash, basically, of Huntress, right? Kind of the same deal. So, um, that's all I have to really say about that. However, um, I am excited to see where this goes. I just don't know why we got an announcement this early. And I'm probably the only one that's been saying this. I mean, if they did an announcement on their, you know, fucking main page like this, I doubt it. However... 
I have a slight suspicion that this is going to be maybe a joke. This might actually not be it. Can't prove it, but I have a hunch. Because if it came out two months early this quick, it's just a little sus. A little sus. So, um, that's all I have to say about this. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And if you're not watching this on Twitch, then what are you doing, dude? You're... Clean gay! Alright, let's move on. The reason you all have parents. Join the stream. Thank you. D Daffy said the best. I'm gonna, I'm gonna end the fucking video on that. Daffy fuck, fucking love you, man.